Hi, my name is Joy Kiriba. I'm a student at Moringa School, currently doing uh, data science. Before joining Moringa School, I was uh, working as an events manager. Um, so I've been in the events industry for a few years. I decided I needed a new challenge. Well, I, I really didn't know much about it before. So I had it, uh, I heard about it from a family friend who had a friend who was here doing software development. So that's how I started my research on the school. And yeah, so I went to the website. I saw the school was, Moringa School was offering um, data science and software development. Um, so initially I would have done software development, but I felt I needed like a broader scope of uh, maybe the technology, the technology world. And um, I've always loved statistics and uh, math. So that's how I landed into data science. My background is in events. So it was a whole new world. So I, I, I haven't done anything computer science, um, statistics. So I, like I was coming in blindly. So it was, it was quite challenging learning to code, understanding the new concepts, especially being an online um, you know, program where you have to study yourself, you have to research, you have to understand the concepts. So it was a bit challenging, but yeah, right now I, have the, I got the hang of it. It's, it's been good having technical mentors who are hands-on, um, you can reach out to them at any time. Having good classmates who are like very open to assist. Um, we have this program, the peer, the peer program where you learn with somebody, um, like you're paired with somebody for like two weeks or so. Um, there's groups, session, regroups. So it's it's been a very different experience, but a good one at the same time. So I can say I'm enjoying it. Considering at Moringa you have content for every day, so I would wake up early, like say five or six, do a bit of studying before the morning stand-up, which is mainly um, around 8.30. Do the stand-up, um, where at least you get to go through the previous day content with your group mates and also have you know a, a snippet of what you're going to study during that day so after the stand up breakfast um, maybe a few chores at home and then get back to studying until maybe the early afternoon and then i can go about um, other things and then maybe in the evening i can get back and yeah if i've not finished the content uh, make sure at least I uh, finished the day's content so that there's no backlog. After Moringa, I would like to, you know, get to the job market. Um, you know, what you study is not what maybe is on the ground, like the practical bit of it. So I'd like to be, uh, to go there, you know, and experience how it is. Um, do a few, uh, do some practice, experience, and then maybe eventually do my own consultancy. What I would advise um, a newbie, somebody who's considering doing the course, is um, go for it. It's, it's a very interesting field. It's, as I said, it's difficult, but with time, as you learn the codes and get uh, to understand the concepts slowly by slowly, you have to first understand yourself. So if this, this is the pace you run, you, you can, you understand things, go with that. You have classmates that who are very fast at grasping things. Don't be discouraged because you might be looking at people, ah, oh, these people are really getting this code so fast. They are the ones who are leading stand-ups, they are leading maybe regroups, and they seem like to know what they are doing all the time. So just do it. And then um, a lot of research. So at Moringa, you're given content, but you have to supplement it with a lot of Go, you research on Google, there's YouTube, so um, you have to learn to learn because the, the normal 844, you're given like 
what notes by the lecturer and there's that's it that is what is tested so at moringa you have to study what you're given and go research understand it better and this is coding coding is not like fi fixed on a specific kind of way of of solving problems so you have to find different ways of yeah, solving the problems that you're given so yeah do, do it it's it's marketable um, yeah and it's it's interesting and fun especially if you have good classmates and people that you know hold you and encourage you to yeah through the hard times uh, my fellow women as in it's it's our time we are we're getting empowered by the day and it's the field is broad it's not for men only. Um, there is enough to go around for everybody. Just come and you know secure your your space. You can do so much, especially for um, for the for the girl child who's maybe in the you know those minorities, those people who are maybe say the northeastern areas. When we all come together in the technological world and we are able to develop things and be able to reach out to those women who are left behind. So we can change quite a lot in our society and be the leaders that we'd want um, to see leading us. Yeah, and be the change, not tomorrow's change, but today's, today's change, yeah.